But before all that, the groundbreaking programs taking place in our region, helping autistic and neurodiverse people into work. It's estimated just one in five autistic people in the UK have a full-time job. Well, those involved trying to up that number say it's not only the right thing to do, but could also give businesses access to a huge pool of untapped potential. Graham Stothard has more. Woodworking under the watchful eye of teacher Ian. Wayne, Matthew and Luke are part of a programme called Making Tracks run by Future Wolverton at the Old School. It aims to help autistic and neurodiverse people into work. Luke struggled with applications but does plenty of jobs here, mentored by site manager Clive. They've got a lot of potential and they can do a good job at what they do. It's just not being able to sell themselves when they go for an interview, so we, we help with that as well. That must be really useful, Luke. How are you finding that? Um, I'm finding it difficult. I think you're building your confidence since you've been here, though. I've noticed yeah. that. You... Yeah, I'm building my confidence up, yeah. yeah. Well, you're doing a TV interview now, so you can't be that, that shy. That's amazing, <laughs> <No>. yeah. <laughs> Problems start for most before a job is even secured. Adults with autism face huge barriers um, in the employment market um, and, and work, really, and yet they're a hugely untapped resource for us, especially during a time where, you know, there are a myriad of jobs that are vacant at the moment. Otter is one of Making Track's success stories working in Daventry, safety testing potentially dangerous materials. I remember a couple of years ago, I was sat there with my dad and I was saying, there's so much I could do if people would just give me a chance, but it's getting that chance that's really hard sometimes. Um, when you don't look the way that people expect you to look, when you don't speak the way people expect you to speak. And um, being linked up with a company that will give you a chance, even if you're a little bit odd, is invaluable. This company adapts its applications, interviews and job roles for neurodiverse people. I think there's a, a huge cohort of people who are very, very capable, maybe differently able, differently capable, but could certainly be filling the skills gap and skill shortage that we have in this country. Cafe Track in Northampton is also part of the Making Tracks programme. I think one of the things we've discovered is there is still a real lack of awareness around autism in general and especially around supporting autistic adults into work and I think by supporting individuals and employers we can see it's now making a real difference. A number of Cafe Track's former employees have gone on to full-time work elsewhere, just like in Wolverton. It's still just a drop in the ocean, but at least it's a start. You got it, you got it. Graham Stothard, ITV News.